Hello guys, what's up? So on today's video, as we guys have seen, as you guys have seen um, before this intro, so I'm gonna show you my bookshelf tour. Um, it's a mess at the moment, uh, so excuse me for that, but I still have to organize this better. Um, well, my well, what, what I'm gonna say about my bookshelf? Well, it's a mess. <laughs> it's a mess. Has a lot of Harry Potter things, as you can probably see here, and a lot of things here from Harry Potter. Some miscellaneous, and um, I'm gonna pull out some, all of the things. I'm gonna start with the first top shelf, then the middle one, then the two bottom ones. And I'm gonna explain a little bit about the books because most of the books I don't know if most of the people have because I don't have a normal library, a normal bookshelf. Some of them you guys might have, some of them you might not. I have a few, a lot of uh, new books in my bookshelf. If you saw my one of my first videos was my book collection. Uh, it's grown substantially since that. Uh, so let's get started because this is going to be a lot of books to show and will be big, 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 including all the miscellaneous that we have here. So first things first, the first thing I'm going to take from the shelf is the miscellaneous things. And the first thing that I have on this bookshelf is my uh, pocket pop keychain, the Stranger Things, and this is the Eleven. I'm not gonna take out of the box because you already know. I think I showed you this one. Uh, I think, or in a video or in a, a post in my Instagram, that you can go and subscribe to my Instagram as well or follow me on Instagram. So this is 11. It cost me five euros, <laughs> five euros for this keychain. I'm probably not gonna use it because as you might know by now from all of these bookshelves, most of the things we don't use, we don't write on it. Uh, most of the things we keep on the boxes. So this is 11 from uh, Stranger Things that I'm hoping th this year they're gonna put out the third season because it's too much time now for <laughs> to wait for a season uh, of them. So this is the first thing that I have. Then I have a, book a bookmark from one of the uh, a library in here in Evra, uh, is uh, where I live. Bookmark with the old man, <laughs> and the oh, this is from a shop. It's called the Bookmark Evra. It's uh, most a uh, few of the, my things that I have in here. I bought there. They are a magical uh, kind of a magical uh, shop, uh, bookshop, book. Yeah, yeah, bookshop. Um, they have a room specifically dedicated to Harry Potter that is amazing. I go there a few times. One of the things that I get there was this Marauders map. This is a small one. They, I think, you can make this by yourself. Uh, I think it, you can find some links to to download this, and you can uh, make one of these. Then the next thing that I have, I don't have here, but I put different things on it. So this is the Honeydukes 10 LED lights. This was uh, the box for the lights, the LED lights from Honeydukes that I bought on Primark. It cost me uh, five, I don't know, three euros, I think. Um, it has uh, small bottles with the sparkles and lights, LED lights, but they are on my room at the moment, so I put all of these things that uh, I have from Harry Potter. The first thing that I'm gonna show you is Fang, the dog, <laughs> from the um, Hagrid dog, Fang. This was a pocket thing uh, that I, that is, uh, let me see, a Funko, this is a Funko of the dog. Okay, then we have Hermione. This is a keychain, it's like the same as the 11, but in Harry Potter. And this is the, oh, uh, no, 
this was a mystery box, a mystery thing. And um, I had uh, Hermione. Uh, so this is her. She has a Funko <laughs> figure. Then on that, uh, I think I have, yes I have, I still have the three things. This is the Lego uh, Harry Potter Fantastic Beast figures. This is the, um, you don't know which one we're gonna get, so you can get all of them, as you can see. And I have three that I bought uh, a few times, uh, a few months ago. I have Harry Potter and uh, Cloak, the Lego version. It still has another one there. <laughs> I don't know why they put two, but this is the first one. Then I have, I think, oh, this is the uh, Newt Scamander with the Niffler. I think, I don't know if you can see, this is the Niffler, Newt and the suitcases. The, the, Fantastic Beast cases. And then I have this one. I don't, I forgot the name of this guy. <laughs> but this is the, a guy from Gryffindor. He's holding the Gryffindor flag. Yeah, so this was my things. The, and this then, or another miscellany that I have is the, sorry, it's a quill. Uh, uh, feather. This is my house, the Slytherin. I bought this on, sorry, oh, and Primark is a pen. It's a writing pen. Oh, <laughs> a writing pen. This is the tip. The tip of the feather. It's green with a snake. I don't know. Yeah, you can see. Then add miscellaneous. Mm. This was this and two more things in here was on the premiere of the Crimes of Grindelwald. Uh, I went to the prim prim premiere with a friend and we got uh, on the cinema a poster from the movie. So I still have to frame this because it's too good to be rolled up. So this is the... Um, the poster, one of the many posters from the movie. I love the movie, cannot wait for the, the next ones. Will be more three, right? Five in total, I think. Then we have another, oh, something's falling. Another thing from Primark that it's still on a box is the wand. It's a Harry Potter wand pen. I showed you this before on my Harry Potter collection. This is the HP wand pen. Cost me two euros on Primark as well. Then I have this little bookmark from the St. Joseph's Indian School. I got this, I don't know, some friend of mine gave me this. Um, it has a quote, I think it's a quote or something. The medicine will the Lakota Sioux people consider the medicine wheel a sacred symbol with much meaning. The circular shape represents a continuous cycle, cycle of life and death. The horizontal and vertical lines represent the sun and man's sacred paths. The center of the earth, indicated here with the lines intersect, where the lines intersect, so it's this part here, um, is where one stands when praying. The four colors, red, black, white, and yellow, are sacred to the Lakota people. So, mm, I don't know what it is, but sorry. <laughs> uh, then the two things that they still gave, they gave us on the uh, premiere of the Fantastic Beasts and the Crimes of Grindelwald was two postcards. This one that has the, 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 it's the postcard that uh, Tina sent to Queenie. Dear Queenie, a beginning day here in Paris, and how about this for a splendid portal to the other side? Always thinking of you, Tina. So this is the lady. One of the entrance to the magic world in Paris. And this is Paris. So they gave us this 
two things. Sorry if I'm too long on this, but I told you. Then yesterday I bought the Bertie Bots flavor bean, every flavor beans on the same shop that sells books, the bookmark. This is the, it's a small package. It only has, uh, I don't know how many, but it's 35 grams, so it's not much. But it's a uh, nice, I think this is still the old package because the new package is more white, I think. Um, and I have to try this ones. I also showed you this uh, on my last video. This is the Lord Voldemort's wand and sticker kit. Was 11.50 cents. Uh, that cost me on the Fnac, in the Fnac shop. I showed you this. I'm not gonna take off the box. You already saw. Then I have this little thing that was that was inside of him. Uh, pin. And I have this little pocket here, in this little bag with the Griffin, the Slytherin pin. It's an enamel pin, I think. Enamel, enamel pin. Sorry. So this is one of the ropes, the Slytherin one, with a snake. Oh, and then I have my Time Turner that I got from Wish. So I don't know if, let me see, no I don't think this will be rotated, no, just to. So this is the time turner. I mark the hours, everyone, nor have, yet. well, you know how the this thing is and works, so I'm not gonna spend too many, too much time on this one too. Then, what we have in here? Well, let's start with some books, I think. Okay, so on top I have uh, Lush, the preservatives handbook from Lush. I bought a, uh, a scrub for my lips uh, on Lush that I forgot to show you a couple months ago. Uh, and I got, and I get the preservatives handbook. So, uh, I don't know, maybe I should throw up, throw, throw this away. So this is one of the things. Then, let's start with Harry Potter books. I think it's better. My newest addiction, addiction, not addiction, my newest uh, thing on my collection of books is the Harry Potter and Fantastic Beasts, a spellbinding guide to the films. Uh, feature content from Fantastic Beasts, The Crimes of Grindelwald. So this is one of the books. That I have from Harry Potter, from the Wizarding World. A fantastic piece breaks new ground. It's time to get up to speed on the films of the Wizarding World. So this is a guide to all of the things from the movies. And uh, eight, nine, eleven, eleven movies so far. So it cost me six euros, I think. Yeah, six euros. So I have this one. Then, from Harry Potter, from the books itself, I, I'm starting to buy the um, the Harry Potter books again because I only have two that I showed you previously uh, on my Harry Potter collection. And now uh, the first one I got this. This is the first one, as you can see. This is the Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone or the Sorcerer's Stone. I don't know how do you guys pronounce that. But I'm trying to buy all of the books with this um, spine, you know? You put all them together and you see the Hogwarts castle. So I'm trying to buy all of them uh, so I can have all the copies because I don't have the physical copies of most of them. Um, so this is the first one. Also have, I think I showed you this, or I'm not sure, I don't think I showed you. Um, this is a mug. This is the ceramic mug. I'm gonna probably show. It's cost. It cost me six euros. This is the a cold drum. Well, I never use it. I don't know if I can. It's a little dusty. Can you imagine. So this is the mug. It's a nice mug, but I don't know. I think it's 
too cute to to be using. <laughs> I know you guys are balancing on a table, sorry. Okay, then, another three things that I got recently was these three notebooks, small notebooks from Primark, three euros, I think, two, two and a half, two and a half euros. So this is Harry Potter, Hermione, and Ron. The three that I have. Then let's continue with books. The first book that I got that I have from Harry Potter. This is an old one. This is from uh, I don't know if I put the date, but this is from 2001, 2002, maybe. It's an old, 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 old. old. This is uh, the Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Uh, this is the Portuguese uh, cover. I don't know if you guys have this in another uh, countries, the same cover, but we in Portugal we have this. This is from the the Editorial Presença. It's a Portuguese uh, company that uh, make books. It's a I forgot the name. Sorry, <laughs> I'm too tired today. And the other one from the movies and the. All of the things Harry Potter is the Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. I gained this on uh, at my work a couple of years ago when we exchange gifts on Christmas, and uh, my colleague gave me this, and I gave him, uh, I gave the person that I have to give something. I think was a bottle of vodka that I gave. Okay, then. I think I already showed you this. This is the gadgets, the cocks, the Harry Potter costs four euros. I showed you this before. It has a lot of things from Harry Potter. And now we're gonna start with the magical books. Let me see if I can show you all of them. Ugh. Okay, so the first one is the A Mala de Cria das Criaturas, Explorar a Magia do Filme, Mons Fantásticos de Encontrá-los. And this is the Newt's book uh, let me see if i can give you the this is the case the there this case um, sorry i'm trying to find the translation <laughs> it's from minalima the um, pictures okay i don't know where it is but you guys know the drill don't show. So this is the case from from its commander. Yeah, it's fantastic piece in order to find them. Okay. So this is one. Oh, I'm gonna be doing this all the time. The other one is this one. Harry Potter, a journey through a, stir a history of magic. Includes fascinating facts from the British libraries. Exhibition Harry Potter a Story of Magic. This is from the Bloomsbury. I bought the English version. Uh, and we still we have a Portuguese version, it's, mm, I think, and we also have the um, hardcover version of this. But this is more. It's, uh, I just bought because I want to read. I still have to read this one. <laughs> so it's. I think you know which book is this. So I don't know if you can. Has a lot of things from the. Um, oh, look, always, always. Then we also have. Okay, so let me try to put all the things back. Because hmm. then we have we have. Oh, oh, sorry, another book that I wrote that I read uh, in two days. <laughs> It's uh, Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, part one and two. What's different to read? Um, because it's right on like a theater, like a theater uh, form. So it's different to read, but it's more uh, quickly to read because uh, you can read this very fast. You don't have to wait uh, like the other books. Then I have two more notebooks. Uh, from 
Primark as well. These two, they are simple. Notebooks, lined notebooks with the HP logo. And they have stars, and I put these two <laughs> things there. Yeah, and you have this bar here. This is the same. Yeah, it's the same. Same, same book. Same, 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 same. Okay, so let's try to put all of this together again. Then we have. Oh, let me. Let me put. Try to start to put this again here. Let's put this one in here. I still have more things from Harry Potter. Maybe I showed you now because it's better to show you. This was on another shelf, but I'm gonna show you right now. This is a, this is not. Uh, I not bought this like this. I just put this because this was from a pajama set from Harry Potter. So I put because I thought it was cute what i have in here i have the uh, beetle and the bard this is the one of the covers that i have i bought this one a couple weeks ago and i'm still reading it i know it's small i should read it all in once but sometimes i get sleepy <laughs> so this is the the book you know this book already let me, let me try then I have another notebook. This is a magical one. Look at this gorgeous. And it has this little, it's like a pencil, but it's a pen. You see? But it says Hogwarts. It's so, so marvelous. And it has this, oopsie, this Harry Potter property of, of Hogwarts school and it's like the other ones with the HP on the bottom of the, the second page and it's marvelous marvelous so let's put this notebook here to no, no, no. let's put it here yes then I have a Slytherin notebook because I'm a Slytherin. This one has the Slytherin on the front and then Hogwarts crest on the pages. I don't know, remember, I think it was two euros, this one. It's not in good shape because, um, I don't know, maybe it's too old. <laughs> okay. And then I have, I never went, I hope I can get there uh, one day. Um, but uh, they sell this here in Portugal, so why not buy it? So this is the making of Harry Potter, the official guide. So this, I think you buy this on the Warner Brothers Studios tour. Uh, maybe they now have a different ones because they added a lot of new things now. So this will be probably uh, updated. And then we have uh, three magical things. Sorry, let me. I'm trying to get myself all these things on the, on the place. Okay, okay. Then the Marauders map. No, let me put this on. Okay. Then we have the three books, uh, The Wizarding World, and we have the Movie Magic. Oh, they are all Movie Magics. So, Movie Magic, we have Extraordinary People and Fascinating Places, Curious Creatures and Amazing Artifacts, all by J.K. Rowling's Wizarding World. Um, so, one is from, it's with um, characters, the other one is the creatures, and the other one is the the artifacts from the movie. So I have the three. I think they have more, 
They have the vaults as well because this is not the vaults. This is different ones, uh, and I still have to buy the vaults. So we have three. Okay, let's try not to. Okay. So the next, uh, sorry, you balanced. The next thing I got this for free uh, on a sh buying when I buy a, bought some things from Harry Potter, I think, or something in the Flux shop. I got the 100, the 20th Century Fox, 100 movies, unforgettable. Uh, they have a lot of um, movies. Look, Schwarzenegger, uh, all that jazz. Well, let me see if they have Aliens, because Aliens is my favorite, one of my, oh, yes, they have Aliens. Sigonary Weaver there and the alien back there So this is another one then a friend of mine gave me this book. It's from William Walker Atkinson Rebirth and the law of karma And the law of karma I think it's the way to translate this this is an old one you can see from the pages are yellow very nice, I love it. It has that old smell, you know. Uh, was printed on the United States of Brazil. Wow, this is... Let me see if, if I can find the edition of this, the year of this. Um, I don't know if I can... Okay, they have this in, in Romanic numbers. I don't remember. So, but I still have to read this one, a friend of mine gave me this. I got also a coffee table book that I'm not using as a coffee table book, but it's here. It's called Great Scapes North America. It's from Taschen. It has a lot of uh, places that you can go and see. It's a good coffee table book. Uh, I love coffee table books. I love books. <laughs> And coffee table books are one of my favorite ones. Okay, then we have small books, I think. Okay, it's not books and you cannot see this. Okay, then we have from Dan Brown, two, two things. Uh, they normally have this in, I don't know if you guys have this in America or where do you live, but here, sometimes in uh, some publications, put these little, these small things from the books. So I have the original book. This is just, uh, I think the first, uh, first two pages, I think. And this is Dunn's Brown Origin. And I have the big book that I still have to read once again. I know I should read more, but work, work gets on the way. It's kind of complicated to read sometimes. So we have this one and we have another one. We have A Lenda dos Cavaleiros das Trevas. This is from Steve Jackson and Ian Livingston. And let me see if I can find the translation. Legends of the Shadow Warriors. Uh, so I think it's a lot of stories couple stories, I think. Ah, uh, no, even. No. It has things. It has. Yes, it has. I never read it. <laughs> I just found this book, so I got it because it's too cute. I love horror movies, horror books. Horror. Then, when I work in a hotel, I'm a receptionist, as you can, as you know by now, I think. And a client uh, left this. Uh, I don't know the travel DC, DK, DK. Witness travel guides. Ah, it's the witness travel guide, uh, and this is Portugal. It's in English but I can read it. It's uh, a map. It's like a, a guide to Portugal. 
Then I have a book that I showed you previously as well on... I don't know what is this. Sometimes I put things on the books, then I forgot them. <laughs> so this is from Holland Hollingerst. Uh, I read The Line of Beauty a couple of years ago and this is the library, uh, the pool library. I think it's the translation. Let me see. The Swimming Pool Library. Alan Hollingerst. I read the first chapter and <laughs> I lost interest on this one. So I forgot to read the, the rest. Then I have this one. I saw the movie and I never read the book. Uh, that's the problem uh, because most of the. Some books have. I only know them because I saw the movie and because I saw the movie I don't don't read the book so it's um, I know I should read and see uh, the movie but yeah. so this is the name of the rose from Umberto Eco it's a big book it's a big book it's I think it's not the biggest book that I have then I have two cooking books from Nigella Lawson my favorite chef the first is uh, in the kitchen with Nigella, I think it's the translation. Let me see again. No, the original title is Nigella Express. Nigella Express, the gorgeous Nigella. And the other one is in the kitchen. Kitchen, the heart of the home, Nigella Lawson. Again. This, I think, was my second book. Yeah, this was my second. I bought that one. This was a gift from a friend on Christmas. Good, I love it so, so much. Now, to the second shelf. First, let me... I know I should do this <laughs> later, but... I have more knickknacks, and if I don't put this together, I'm gonna lose track. Oops, sorry again. Sorry again. Ugh, I have to put these things, all these things. That's. Oh, oh Jesus. Hermione, please stay there. Oh. I have the brother. Okay, oh, I forgot this. Okay, the knickknacks I have on the second shelf is a playing cards from Pepsi. This is old, 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 old. It's too old. This is a. You know how the playing card is, so it's cards <laughs> that you can play with. Then I have a candle from Glade. This is warm, wintry hug. Uh, pineapple, oh, not pineapple, apple and cinnamon. Oh, and it smells so delicious. Oh my god. Oh, so so good. Then I have a, a game. I don't know if you guys know this or you guys have this. This is Mikado. It's a game that you have these things. It's like a these little things you put on a table and then every player has to take them without touching the other things the other well you have this like that and you take one and then you have to take the other ones without touching the rest of the these little things it's so fun to play this they should put more things on this then I also have from Dragon Ball the a star one of the balls this is the six one two three four five six this is the six and it has the oh i forgot the name <laughs> i forgot the name of him of them of him oh senna it's not senna i think it's i don't know you guys can google it <laughs> and try to find then i have another playing card this is from compal 
this is a Portuguese brand of uh, juices, natural juices. I love this uh, brand. And I also have Uno, another card game. Let's start with the books. First, on this side, I have my favorite. I still have to read this. Sorry, I know. It's Inside the Dream, Britney. The biography from Stephen Dennis. Stephen Dennis, I don't know, oh, this, this guy. And you have the gorgeous Britney. So this is a biography until the um, circus era, you know, because this is the outfit that she used, uh, used to use on the circus tour. Has a couple of pictures. Uh, from all of the things that she went through, unfortunately. Let me. I think this is. It's not doing well. Oh, because it's too. Mm. Okay, this part that I'm not gonna show you because I don't like that part of her. These parts. So it's a biography, as you can see. Then I have another one. This is until more later, later, no, um, it's more older uh, biography. This is Britney biography from Sean Smith. He has a lot of another biograph uh, books. Mm, and this also has some pictures, the, this images. So this is biography from Britney. Then I have this book. It calls the Seven Wonders of the Ancient World, and it's an amazing book about the Seven Wonders from the old, old world. It's a nice book as well. Then a client uh, left this as a gift for the for us at our work. He also left some a note. It's a book from Antonio Lubantunes, Quinto Lift Chronicles. It's the five, fifth book of Chronics. Uh, I think it's Chronics. This is the old, old. It's the complete collection, uh, um, collection of the the Chronics that he wrote on a journal here in Portugal. And then we have a small book. Because we also have small books in here. It's from Bill Bryson. It's the Prev Story de Quas Tudo. Let me see. Let me see the translation because sometimes I forgot how to. A short story of nearly everything. So this is the book. I still didn't read this. <laughs> I know. I should read more books, but I'm too busy at work. Um, all of these right now. Mm. Don't tell. Two and more. Okay, then I have another book. It's from one of the most uh, gorgeous uh, TV hosts here in Portugal. It's from Cristina Ferreira. Sentir, feel, feeling, or feel. It's a biography, autobiography, almost. Uh, it's an amazing book. So if you guys have a chance to find this book on your country, go read it because it's a nice read. It's a small book, but it's, uh, you can read this uh, in two days, three days. It depends on how fast, on, on how do you read. Then I have a book that uh, the year that I born, 1988. Now you can make the math and see how old I am. This is a book they sell here in Portugal. I don't know if you guys have this in your country, but this is a compilation of all the things that happen on the year that you born, that you were born. So I have this one from 88 and I have this one that I gained for free. I have a few books here that are free because I um, went to the, um, it's like you, uh, you can, uh, you have a, some sites, some pages on the internet that you can uh, get free things to home.
for your home. So I got this, this is holidays or holy days. Does it matter which days we observe? I don't know from which one. Uh, what is this? Uh, this is from the published by the United Church of God, an international association. So um, it's a, a book. It's a book. Then we have a cooking, another cooking book. This is the Viva Melhor, a cozinha com a cozinha saudável. So this is the um, healthy res recipes, some healthy recipes that you can make, that I still have to make. Then another free book from that site that I told you, uh, the O Mistério dos Séculos, from Herbert Armstrong. And Herbert Armstrong... This is from the same church. So, I don't know, I have this, so... I interest... Mysteries of the Ages is the translation. Uh, I love these subjects, I want to know more about all of the religions and all of the, those things, so that's why I have different books on my, that most of the people don't have. Then I have this book that a friend gave me, it's Kenzel Gius from Jai, it's Terra Branca Editora. This is, uh, this is poetry, but this is hard poetry it's not hard to read it's hard because and that's it's not hard the word it's um well it has a lot of uh <laughs> words that you're not supposed to say uh, like hmm. i think i can read this one if you can find a translation to this um, you can see what I'm reading I'm gonna read this in Portuguese so uh, I'm sorry if you cannot understand what I'm saying but this is the third poem I should read the first one the second one because I think this has um, I think I'm gonna read the first one. It says: Uma foda com manda além da natureza, uma foda vadia. A puta que encontra o cabrão certo ou vice-versa nunca mais quer constituir família. Comer e fazer amor exige preguiça. Sorry. Sorry. Comer e fazer amor exige espírito de preguiçoso. Poeta que escreve muito é porque não fode com a musa. Sorry about all the language, the hard, the strong language, but it's a great book. Then a friend. Uh, gave me this one too, and it's from Daniel Sampaio, Lições do Abismo. It's from, uh, from um, patients in a hospital, in a psych. psych uh, psych oh god, I forgot. Psychiatrist. No, uh, I don't know. It's from. <laughs> It's good, it's good. Okay, then one of the books that it's more, uh, it's, it's good but controversial, it's the O Evangelho de Judas, this is from the National Geographic, and this is the Judas, uh, I don't know, let me see the translation, I sometimes forgot the fucking words. The Gospel of Judas from Codex Tacus. So that's, that's from the Gospel. This is the Judas Gospel that I wrote, that I read. It's good, it's very good. It's a nice book. Okay, then I have the most important, the most amazing uh, writer in Portugal um, from the Renaissance it's our greatest uh, uh, 
uh, writer. Uh, he has a lot of poetry and he has a book that called Lusíadas from Luís Vaz de Camões. This is one of the most amazing books. I, sh I think Hollywood should get this and make this as a freaking movie because it's too good to pass. It's, it's about our story in Portugal, our, uh, how do we found uh, all of the places in the world because we start the um, uh, sailing and when to discover things. Uh, so this is an, an amazing story. This is about the journey from Portugal to India um, and it's, uh, it's so, so good. It, oh my God, it's my favorite uh, book. I read this on school and I, I mes it's mesmerizing how amazing uh, the book is. So you guys should get this and read so you can understand more about our Portugal so about Portugal and about our story and Hollywood if you are watching hopefully hopefully you guys are watching you guys pick this and make a great movie two movies even because this is a lot of stories you can do a different movie because these are as chapters so you can make a lot of books um, movies so come on come on let's go Okay, then, and these are now, okay, we are almost one hour on this. This is one book that I wrote, that I got. It's Eu Escrevo Meu Primeiro Romance. It's a, a guide to how to write your first novel, uh, because I want to write my first novel. And I got this because I need some tips on how to, right? Then I have a book from Michelle Munina. It's an Italian uh, girl. It's Lady Gaga, the life, the songs, and the dreams of a bad girl. It's good. It's good. I already read, read it. It's about Lady Gaga, so <laughs> you know, Gaga, Lady Gaga, Stephanie. Then one of the books that brought me into the reading was this one from Catherine Howe. O Livro de Feitiços de Deliverance Dane And this is the translation This is about the Witches of Salem The Physic Book of Deliverance Dane It's so good, so good, so good I read this, I read this at work uh, And she has a lot of more books But this is so, so, so good it's a big book, but it's a nice book about the Salem trials and the witches of Salem. Then we have a collection. Three books that I still have to read the last one, but I'm gonna show you. I already read the first one. This is the Miss Peregrine Home for Peculiar Children, the first one. Then we have the City Without Soul. And Library of Souls. I still have to read this one, the third one. Uh, I read the first and the second, and I didn't like. Uh, well, I liked the movie, but I didn't like some things on the movie. You can see my uh, review on my uh, site, on my blog. It's prerogativeismy.blogspot.com. Uh, you can go there and read my. Um, review of the of the the movie okay then another book that i got a couple years ago it's from paul hoster uh, new york trilogy it's it's a book <laughs> i never read it but it's a nice one then I got another one in one of the fairs that we have here. Uh, it's called, it's from Antonio Ferreira, it's a Portuguese book. O Comboio de Lucifer, The Lucifer Train. It's a poetry book, I think, or prose book, or a book. Book, it's a book. It's a book. <laughs> it's a book. But not to spend much time on each book, because 
We are gonna be here a lot of fights. Okay, another free one. This is the Forward by Francis Chan. No longer a slum dog. Slum dog bringing hope to children in crisis. The Ki P. Yohanan. K. P. Yohanan. This is the is the founder of and the international director of the Gospel of, for Asia. So it's a. I've never read it. Sorry. Mm. But it's a book from uh, children's in crisis. The other one that I have, I think it's the same author. It's called Revolution in World Missions. One man's journey to change a generation. So it's about missions uh, that this guy does uh, around the world. So. So it's nice, then we have another one of that books from religion. This is the Para Além da Imaginação, Beyond Imagination by Baldwin Gibson Thomas. Uh, it's a small book, but with a lot of information. Um, that I still have to read as well. Then I have a book that uh, my cousin gave me a couple years ago too. Uh, Lições dos Gurus da Bolsa. This is from Nikki Ross and the translation sometimes. Lessons from the Legends of Wall Street. So it's lessons from the Wall Street. From one, two, three, four, five, I think. Then we have a book from school that I happen to read from school. From Freilich Sos is a play. Uh, I'm not, uh, well, it's from Almeida Garret in the book called uh, Frei Luis Souza. It's a play. And I have to roll, read this in school. It's an old book, too. Then we have another book from Viva Melhor com Atividade Física. This is a book with the exercises and how to do some exercises, what should we do in some cases of health and let's see up here for me to read then we have another guide this is my first time that i got the, a new york guide and it has my little sister uh and a couple of things in here that i forgot <clears throat> okay so this is the new york guide the american express no, it's not the American Express. It's the same that the other one from Portugal that I showed you before. It's a nice, nice. I love it. I learned so much about New York without get even there. Then I have a new of uh, a book from one of the places here in Portugal. It's Montserrat and it's Royals Royal State. It's about Montserrat. It's a place here in Portugal. It's a medieval place that you can go and have a look to the biggest um, lake, the biggest artificial lake in Portugal or in the Europe. Then we have a couple more of the of books, three books from a place here in Everett, it's the photography and digital video courses, uh, the digital, the, the Digital video, digital video programs and formats, and um, try. Uh, no, uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's a book. It's like a three book from. Uh, it's a courses from one of the journals, uh, the newspapers um, here. Then I have this little thing that I take from a, book, a magazine. It's receitas para todos os gostos from Filipa Gomes, it's one of the most amazing Portuguese chefs. So and this is the sweet one, the sweet edition. <laughs> because I'm, I love sweets. Then uh, when I work in a coffee place, a restaurant, like a restaurant, we went to Delta, it's the Portuguese brand of coffee, uh, to have a workshop there. They gave us this, this is the arts, of coffee this is the art of coffee in one sign and this is the 
espresso perfect, the perfect espresso, with a lot of tips and how to make the perfect espresso. And then a small book, it's the religious book as well, but uh, I like to know a few things more. And this is the Caminho para a Vida. Okay, then I have two notebooks here. Two, two, just two. Two notebooks. Uh, it's normal notebooks. I still not write anything on them because they are just two. This is the London one has these gorgeous pages that I still have to find a way to utilize and then I have this one this I have things write it right on it my second book is starting here <laughs> well I have to get my hands on it so I can so it's a normal uh, notebook then 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 let's see if we can okay this is more uh, books from so they are all religious related the first is the bible fact or fiction let's hope i'm not gonna say what i think because maybe it's not too is god a trinity another book from the same then the revelation the mystery unveiled then i have living water a gospel of john with notes and it has the radical message of god's word however belie whoever believes in me has eternal life jesus christ okay jesus then or Kolobus or the red planet It's a small one. Then Jesus Christ, the true story. It's another one of the same books. Uh, what is your destiny? And the book of the apocalypse revealed. So it's more religious books. Sorry, oopsie. Almost an hour now. Okay, then I have another book from New York, but this one I bought myself. No, I think I bought that one myself. This is the oldest one. Okay, this is the oldest one, yeah. Because I wrote some things on here, yeah. So this is the other one. This is, I think, still with the two towers. The Twin Towers, I think. This one still has the Twin Towers. Um, the other one doesn't. Okay, then we have... Oh, this is an amazing book. Another book. This is uh, Christmas Stories. The Miracle of the Blue Dog. It's so gorgeous, so cute, this, uh, this book. The book was written by Inês Pedrosa. It's a Portuguese uh, writer. Then we have another book from that religion, the same religious stuff. Uh, Valorize mais a sua vida. For, uh, uh, sorry. It's another book that I should get rid of. Then we have. I don't know if I had that many books the last time. Oh, it's the Biographic Dictionary of No Eboreses. Dictionary Biographic de Notáveis Eboreses. It's a book about all of the famous people from Evora, the place that, I, that I'm living. Then we have uh, another one that is cute. This is the Livro da Sabedoria do Lar from John Vara and this is from 2002 so it has a lot of years now Home Wisdom 
home wisdom. Then we have another small book, but this is the O Cavalinho de Pau do Menino Jesus from Manuel Antonio Pina. Very nice too. Then we have a big book with medicinal plants for teas. It has a lot of information. It's a Viva Melhor com as Plantas Medicinais. It's a nice book, has a lot of uh, plants that you can use to, uh, to do a lot of things, to recover from things, for health. For your health. Then, this is things that you can do. Then I'm gonna put it here. Oh. Oh, oh. Right, okay. Okay, then we have oh. Then I have three oh. little magazines from the National Geographic. This is the climate changes, uh, the state of the planet, the seas and the ocean. It's a gorgeous three magazines. Then we have a pop-up book that I showed you before as well. And it's my the Alice in Wonderland, Lewis from Lewis Carroll, Open Me and Discover Strange and Extraordinary Surprises. So it's a pop-up book. Let me get the castle because it's the most thing the thing that you guys will Probably. It's not a castle, it's the... <laughs> like this. You see? Oh, you not see. You see? Alice. Look, Alice. <laughs> it's a nice book. I don't remember... Oh, it's cost me almost 20 euros for this book. Then I have another book. This is the fashion icon. Pop. The Queen of Pop fashion icon. Oh, if I can get it out. Oh, okay, it's the Lady Gaga one. Queen of Pop icon of fashion with a lot of pictures from Lady Gaga. Very nice as well. Then I have one of the winners. Guinness World Records and this is the 2011 one that I have they sell this in 2011 I think yeah or 2010 I don't even know has a lot of things I'm still in here so I only read this part I still have to read all of this because it's interesting to to see these things and then I have a book with the wonders of nature from around the world and let me oh God. Oh. let me try let me try oh. okay then I have, this is the wonders of nature it has a lot of things that you can see around from around the world very nice. Then we have a book. This is a companion book of the terrible diary, the terrible, the lost, terrible diary of Dr. Cornelius Van Helsing. It's called Vampires. So it's it's not a pop-up book, but he's a soft book. Uh, it has a lot of things that you can pull out and see about vampires and. All of those things. I bought this mostly because I love it and for research because I'm writing so I have to have some research physical copies of for research I don't I, I don't mind to go on Google and search but I prefer uh, books. Books, books. Then we have Gaga just Gaga <laughs> from Johnny Morgan. This is a coffee table book as well. It has 
It's a story from Lady Gaga. So it's an I, I think I read this one. All of it. Okay, now we're gonna go to the next shelf. On the next shelf, I'm not gonna pull out everything because most of these magazines is the Christina magazine that I have and I showed you this on my previous video. The Harry Potter doll from Mattel. And I also have this I can show you because I never showed you. It's the 2019 Harry Potter calendar that I'm still have on the plastic bag and this is the images that you can have for each month it's the end you have a poster inside this poster the dragon from Gringotts and they on top of the the beast then we have Try to, to put all of these things. Oh, this candle, Jesus Christ. Okay. This, like so. Sorry, I should not be doing this right now. Okay, then we have. Evra with light. So it's a book. Uh, it's a photography book with about the light. Some images about light. It's a nice book. Very nice. Then I have the the, 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 the Vinci Leonardo da Vinci, the complete. Uh, work of painting it's a coffee table book from Tashin as well and you have a lot of uh, things let me find our gorgeous Mona Lisa because it's one of my favorite paintings let me see if I can find her oh here she is oh this is a copy This is one of the versions of Mona Lisa, but the most recognizable. I don't know if it's this one. Maybe it's this one. I don't think so. Well, I still have to read this because this is all the information about these paintings. So it's nice to know uh, a few things. So it's a nice book. I love Zura da Vinci work. Then I have two books. Another. It's a diology. <laughs> I gained this on a competition. It's a yeah, like a competition. You can say that. I answered the question right, and I gained these two books from the Terror uh, from IMC. And the books are from Dan Simmons, The Terror Volume Two. And the terror volume one so this is the volume two one and this is the volume two that I still have to read and the question was which uh, producer was producing this and I uh, uh, answer Ridley Scott the guy that makes our amazing alien movies or at least produce them right so i have these two then i have this book that i bought because i'm too out of shape <laughs> it's called uh, burn fat it's more than 100 recipes uh, to uh, lose weight to help lose weight it has a lot of recipes as well then I have this one. This is a book that I bought as well. This is Hotel, the backstage of a hotel. So it's it's a nice book. I still have to read it, all of it, but 
it's a book about my job. Uh, I know I should not be reading all of the things about my job, but I love my job. So I read uh, a lot of things uh, about my job. Then a friend of mine gave me two books, two cooking books, more two books for cooking. This is a, with the Portuguese celebrities. It's a famous in the kitchen or kitchen with famous, cooking with famous. I think it's the best translation. Uh, it's 100 recipes from people that we know, like Jules Isidro or um, Jorge Gabriel. Uh, let me try to find Erwin Jose. A lot of them. So it's a it's a nice book, a cooking book. Then she also gave me this book that I saw a couple of years ago that I thinking that I was thinking to buy then. But then she gave me this, it's the Desperate Housewives, the cooking book with the, all the recipes. I don't know if it's the real recipes or the recipes from them, um, but I think it's from the, the, the show itself, not from them, all of them. Uh, but this is the Housewives book, the cooking book, that I still have to read with more detail because I only passed through. And then we have three magazines. These are free magazines on FNAC. FNAC is the Portuguese shop that I bought most of the things that I have in here. And this is called Stand FNAC. It's like a magazine with uh, all of things bookish related most of the time. Uh, and I have this, this is a free item that we get on the library, on the shop. And then I have drinks on the bottom uh, left of this uh, Muscatel. Muscatel. I have limoncello, wine, uh, wine, wine, and wine. <laughs> okay, so I think we are done. We are completely done with this. So I think I'm gonna finish here. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I don't know if I have more books. Well, I have one more. It's from Neil Gaiman, the American Gods, that stars uh, make um, had made uh, a series, the first season only, <laughs> until now. I'm still waiting for the second season. Uh, I never read the book. I still need to read the book. But, you know, I'm always busy. Okay, I hope you guys have enjoyed this uh, little, not so little, one hour and 15 minutes uh, showing you all my collection of books, my bookshelf tour. Um, if you guys like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you don't, well, give it a thumbs down, you know. Uh, comment if you have some questions about all my books or some of the books that I showed you. and subscribe to my channel because i'm trying to post most more times now um, i had a video a couple days ago from my unboxing of the mattel doll and the voldemort wand and now i showed you my bookcase book shelf tour book 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 bookalicious it's the new word that i'm putting invented and well I'm gonna go because I'm tired. I hope you guys like it, so I'll see you on the next one. Bye!